Hey, welcome back to KSL Outdoors. Well, we've moved out of the mountains down here to the valley to the Ogden Bay Waterfowl Management Area where biologists are looking to kill carp. All to benefit waterfowl. Okay, so we are gonna do some carp control out at Ogden Bay today out in unit one. Jason and I'll go out and charge all the barrels on the outside. Dave and Chad will be in the marsh master and they're gonna go out in these standing ponds. What we have on all of our waterfowl management areas are a lot of carp, which are non-native invasive species. So carp are bottom feeders. So they're, they're looking for invertebrates on the bottom. They, they make the water very turbid and for the single pond weed to grow, it needs to be able to photosynthesize. So take carp out of the system, you have nice clear water and that allows the photosynthesis to happen with the sago pond weed and the growth will be incredible this fall. Liquid rote known is derived from a plant in South America. It's from the root. And what the rote known does is we treat it three parts per million and it just puts a film on the fish's gills so they suffocate and die. So what we do is we use 30 gallon barrels. We'll uh, determine how many CFS we're treating and what the surface area of the water already was. And a lot of these 30 gallon barrels are just getting one gallon of liquid rote known. And it's got a drip that drips 140 milliliters per minute. Rich has lowered the water here at the Ogden Bay WMA to concentrate the carp and minimize the amount of the area that needs to be treated. This also reduces the impact on the invertebrates in the system. We got uh, 84 water control structures replaced last year so we were able to drain the ponds down and we're treating the minimum amount of water possible so we're using a lot less rote known than other years. We'll end up using about 50 gallons so probably about a five to six thousand dollar project. We've got 23 barrels set up today, so it's a, it's a really big project, but we're gonna have a positive impact on about 7,000 acres. So we'll do more in the next 36 hours than what we can do for the rest of the year up to the duck hunt by taking the carp out of the system. We're throwing everything we've got at them. We're using the Marsh Master and getting places we've never been able to get before, thanks SFW. The effect of Rotenone happens almost immediately. In just a few hours, hundreds of carp are starting to roll over. Two days later, thousands of carp are dead. Rotenone only works for about two days, and it quickly dissipates from the environment. Next fall, everybody is going to be complaining about all the sago pondweed on their props on Unit 1, and we'll take that as a compliment and that we did a good job. Well, just after a few hours since biologists have treated this water, two, three hundred carp already belly up. Rich says in a couple days there'll be hundreds in many of these waters. Next year they'll pick another WMA to do a similar project.